Good morning everyone, welcome back. You're out in glorious fishing and today we've got something a little bit special. We're going out on Wahoo Fishing which is a commercial fishing boat. He also has a YouTube channel and we're going commercial fishing for turbot on rod and line. So I hope you're gonna enjoy it. The car's here, we're gonna start making our way down towards the boat. Let's go get him. So I've made it to the pontoon. I think this is the right pontoon. Tom is just running a little bit late. So I just thought I'd give you a show of his boat. I'm pretty sure this is the boat here. I think it's a 24 foot aquafish. Not quite sure on that. We'll get the details of when he gets here, but it is a fine, fine fishing boat. Perfect for going turbot fishing around Albany. And there it is. I'm sure that's his boat there. Let's see if it says Wahoo on the back. If it says Wahoo, we got the right boat. I think it is. I can't see. I'm pretty sure this is his fine vessel. Lovely, lovely boat. Nice wheelhouse, nice heaters for today. It's minus one at the moment, so it's pretty damn cold. Yeah, he's a registered commercial fisherman. So we're gonna go up, try and catch some commercial turbot, rod and line only, no trots or anything like that. And hopefully gonna have a good day's fishing. Well everyone, what a fine ship. Really pleasure to be going out on a boat like this today. It's gonna to be absolutely fantastic up round Alderney. Drifting the casket sandbanks. It's a big sandbank, it's about four or five miles long. Very, very big sandbank, full of turbot and brill. Not sure if they're gonna have a lot of turbot and brill fishing over them in January, but I've had double figure turbot in Guernsey. No problem at all round Alderney. So hopefully we can hook into a few today. The vessel itself. One day, hopefully, I'll be able to own a ship like this. Hopefully Tom Ory's up, we can get fishing. So Captain Tom has arrived everyone. Morning. Ready to go and sail the high seas for these turbo. Let's go and fuel up and go and get them. I mean, lots of new boots to the occasion. Fueling up. Just chucking out fuel in. So everyone, Tom has loaded up the boat with fuel. I think we put 180 litres of diesel in. As you can see, it is a fabulous day. I couldn't pick a better day to go out turbot fishing with Tom. So hopefully we're gonna smash into some of these flatties. Let's go get them. Commercial turbot rod and line fishing. You can't beat it.
everyone, we're cruising. We're heading up to Albany now. Tom's out there rigging up the rods. We're on autopilot. Tom's boat is a 23 foot aqua fish. Here's some of the gadgets. As you can see, we're heading up towards Alderney. Alderney is through the windscreen there. I don't know if you can see it. We're heading up to a place called the Casket Sandbags, notorious for turbos and brill. And we're heading up there, hopefully to get a few. Autopilot's there, sounders there, Garmin plotters there. We're heading up there, guys. Let's go get them. So we just arrived, the rods are out. We're just coming over the edge of the bank now, our first drift. We've got four rods out. We're using mackerel and sand eels, Tom's there. We're loving it, it's absolutely flat calm. You couldn't have asked for a better day out here, turbot and brill fishing. Let's get the fish. Again. Oh, a greedy, greedy turbot down there somewhere. That's why I usually like to start a little bit further away from the bank, so it, you know, you've already got that deep water. Yeah, yeah. So as it comes up, you know it's in contact with the bottom, yeah, no yeah. matter how much line you let out. It's always going to be in contact and go over the top. Right, that'll do for that one. And then this one. Yeah, I'm going to keep this one short. I find it always takes a drift or two just to get into it as well, yeah, just yeah. to get set up. I think that'll be the best option though. Next drift, I won't go down. Wait till you're out here and then we'll both go down together. Everything's in our favour today. So Tom's into the first fish. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it carefully because you never know it is. Yeah. I'll get the net ready just in case it's a small one. Hopefully it's a small turbot, everyone. I'm gonna try and keep out the way of the camera. Oh, the camera's over there. Yeah. The cameras are rolling, baby. The camera's rolling, and we're fishing, and we're catching. So a bit, a bit rusty. There's a bit of weight there though. I'm going to wait if I thought this was going now. I'm going to let that one go off. I'll have to just watch this line here. There you are, you've got the lead up. What is that? Turbot. That's a turbot. First one. It's a brill, isn't it? Turbot, small turbot. Oh, lightning hook. Beautiful. That's the key for that, I think, just about. Yeah, that's a small turbot. Small turbot. Beauty. There we go. What we oh, come out for, look, mate? That's lightly hooked that. Look at that. Oh. Wowzers. Yeah, that's what we came out for. There you go, guys. Ooh. First turbot of the year. And they're here and they're feeding. New beauty. January turbot, eh? Okay? Who could have thought? Who would have thought January turbot? Beautiful Lovely. fish. Is that a keeper? I've got a, yeah, that's a keeper. I've got a, I've got a, um, I've got a gauge here. Oh, uh, that's definitely it. I'm gonna, I'm coming. I'm surprised if that ain't in. What's the size again? I've got 30. Yeah, that's all of 38, 30, 39, that. Nice keeper. He's coming with. He's coming with. Beautiful. Let's get some more. So everyone, there's Tom's turbot there. Fine representation of a turbot and his other rod's going off as well. So hopefully that's going to be another fish. But a fantastic turbot, lovely, lovely flat fish. Very expensive fish here in the restaurant. So uh, yeah, absolutely love catching these fish. It's the first turbot of 2024 out on Tom's boat. Couldn't beat it, it's a fantastic day up here. Hopefully we get some big ones. Let's get them. It's, it's, it's 
two degrees. Yeah, that'll be all right, mate. Right, let's see if we've got anything on here. Right, see right on that, right on that mark there. I even marked it with a little fish symbol because straight over the top of it. Well, this is not what I'm doing now. Right, let's see if we've got anything on Fish on. Oh, Tom's fish. fish on. Fish on again. <laughs> I better get the net. Oh, it looks like I'm going to be net man today. No, well, hopefully not. Oh, hello. That's not a doggy. No, flatties, chap. I told you up here for flatties. That's not a doggy. No one believes me. Let's go up caskets. We'll get flatties. Pete, get swat on. <laughs> That's, um, is this, is this you've only got that little bit of mackerel on that. That yeah, little, that little piece bit, of mackerel. Yeah, got a circle hook, yeah. Oh. Good old circle hook. He's going to take it nice and gentle. You watch this time, it'll be a doggy. Now you've said it's yeah, not. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. On the, on the mackerel. <laughs> ah, beautiful. At least we're hooking into a few fish now, guys. Fantastic. We're up here around Alderney. We've steamed about 16 miles. So, worth it. long trip for the turbot. But if you're catching them, it's well worth it, like Tom says. So, Worth a bit of diesel. Yeah. <laughs> see how I don't use. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't use circle hooks either. So I'll be interested to see how this one's hooked, whether it's a dog ear or flat or whatever. I thought I'd just add some weight on that then. We'll definitely do this drift again. They're sat, they're sat quite far back, quite far back, and they're not, they're not over the top, they're in that, they're in deeper waters, down here. Yeah, you caught my line here. Have I? Hang on, let's go. Which way? Which side am I? That side. That's it. Oh, I'm round and, I'm round and over, so I'm going to have to come round. Sorry about this, everyone. Yeah, it's a flat eight. That's a better one. Oh, it's a little bit better. It's still a flat eight. Right, then we just cut that trace quickly. Get out of your way. It's only just round this rod, mate. So if yeah. you um, Hang on now. if you just do that, yeah, okay. I think so. Over the what? Over and under, or under right. and over, over and under. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Okay, boss. Thank you, thanks a lot. Thank you, I'll take that. You've got a bite? I don't know, I think that was then. Second turbot, same drift. Oh. Oh. Beautiful. Just about a keeper that one. A bit smaller actually. But... Two turbot, first drift. We're catching them. Tom's catching them. You'll, you'll get one, mate. You'll get one. You will You'll get one. They're here. That's the main thing. Right. I'm going to bring up the rods. We're going to go up for another drift. Catch his or her grandma. Everyone, fish on. Right. I'll leave that one there for a second. Nice. I don't know if this is a turbot. Are we rolling here? Are we rolling down his in. We've got our third turbot for the, uh, for the, for the oh, drift. I don't, I don't know if it's a turbot. I've three, definitely got something off. Three turbot on one drift, right? Be nice. Unheard of, other than this time here. What is it? It's a cuttlefish. It's a big cuttlefish. We'll keep it. Wait. Right, let's quickly, let's open this up. We've got yeah, a cuttlefish there, it's everyone. It's Not what we show. want. I'll give you a show without inking down out. I'll bring it over. There you go. Lovely cuttlefish there. We'll keep him as bait. Fantastic. Beauty. Sonny's just screamed off here. Danny's in something good. It's either a, it's either a cloak or a big bass. Hopefully a big bass. This line's going as well. This oh. line's going. They're all going. What we got, Dano? I don't know, mate. Don't feel... Oh, it just came off. Just, ca just come yeah, off. It just come off. Has it? Maybe it's chomped you. Hang on, this one's going. I'll get this one. 
I felt the up come out. Anything? What was that, Grant? It's a tape that bit you off, maybe? Uh, I reckon it's because I slack light. No, look, tape. Tape, yeah. Had you? Yeah. Who would have thought tape would be up here this time of year? Where everyone? Right, we've just gone right round where we may as well fish this side now. Sorry about that, but yeah, I got absolutely nailed by a tote. <laughs> The cleanest. Well, I'm just going to bring my line round here. My lovely fresh bait. Sorry, Chief. Gone. Gone. It's gone. Oh, this one's still, this one's still going out. Yeah. Absolutely nailed. Shame that one. Left. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? Just carry on fishing this side. Yeah. Here? We're here now. We've got point going up to go. Pandemonium here though. Pandemonium on the vessel. Dan's bait got absolutely devastated there. <laughs> devastated right. <laughs> I thought, what the hell? I wouldn't have thought the tofu was this time here, but. I, thought, good, I thought it was a big bass. Yeah, that would have been that would have been nice to be a big bass. That, that nice screamed off! You never know what's gonna happen up here. Yeah. Oh well, absolutely banged off. Hopefully you get some more turbot. What a day! Everyone, just thought I'd give you a run through of the baits. Got some mackerel fillets up here. I've also got a mackerel fillet flapper that I'll be putting on. Sand deal that I've uh, filleted all the sides off of it, taking all the fillets off, and that's what that tote just took uh, my rod for an extremely massive run. Yeah, the rods are out. We're going to pull them back up in a minute and go up for another drift. Well, Tom's only in again. Let's see what this is. I like that. Don't know. So take it nice and gentle again. Come on to the caskets. We'll catch turbot in glorious said. Tom's catching turbot. Well, I'll catch all the small ones. Get them out of the way for your big one. <laughs> I might manage to sneak a turbot on the very end of the drift. I don't know. Get the net just in case. Might well be a dog or a cuttle or something. Come on. No, it's a, it's a dog. It's a dog. Right, dog fish. Oh yeah, I'm not netting doggies. Pot bait. Yeah, why not? Pot bait all day long. Let's go up for another drift. I'll just chuck in the bucket there. Sandeels. Sandeels in January. Perfect. Fish oh. on everyone. Again. Yeah. Oh, he's come off again. There's, there's something very keen on this one. There's something very keen on this one. I'm just going to give it a little line. Dan is going to catch up on the turbot, on the turbot front. Oh, that feels better now. Hold up, trap. This don't feel like a dogfish now. Good. This, this is pulling nicely. There's a turbot. There's a turbot on the end of this one as well. But oh, trying, hold up. Oh, I'm trying to hook it. I'm trying to hook it. Unless, unless you caught this. I don't know line. what's on this. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna keep this one. I'm just gonna keep giving this one line because there's something for you. We need the net soon. What is that? That's oh, just a doggy, mate. Is it? Oh. He's just twisted. Oh, he was coming off all like as if he was biting his tail. Oh, That's not very good. Oh well, it's a fish. He was coming off in circles, which is why he felt heavy. He was coming off in a ball. More pot bait. Mm. 
Pandemonium! Well, might have a small dogfish on again here, everyone. You want to be nothing. It feels like there's something. I haven't got your line, have I? Just in case, you never know, do you? you never know. Should we be seeing it soon? Doggy? I know you got my line. It's a dog, eh? It's a dog. Oh, no, it's a gurnard. It's a big gurnard. There you go, nice. Beauty. They're good eating this gurnard, aren't they? Yeah. Hang on, pop, nice top gurnard there. It's got to be near a couple of pound. Not bad top gurner at all. Lovely, lovely fish. Another one for the fish box. There's fish going there now. Just, he just coughed up a weaver fish, I think. I think. Oh yeah, yeah, it's a weaver, yeah. What a day out there, wow. What a day. There you go. And a nice, nice top gurnard. Beautiful blue on the fins here. Lovely, lovely fish. Great eating fish. Absolutely fantastic. And bosh him on the head. Yep. Yeah. They're all beating stick. Hang on. They've they got very bony heads, haven't they? Bit of weight. Maybe not a Gary Gurnard. Well, we'll, yeah, keep your line off anyway, because we'll, yeah. we'll be back up. I'm going to try that northern, we'll try that northern drift and we'll back down into this area. Yeah, we'll get this one out by sand deal. Next drift, we'll be putting on the mackle flapper fillet. Fish on. See a little bit of weight on the rock. Oh yeah, there's definitely something there. We'll find out. Well, there's something here. Whether it's a dogfish or a turbot, I don't know. But we're in. We're standing by. Unless they're ready. Come on, get off the old, get onto the turbot scorecard. Let's hope so. Can't just have you catching turbot. <laughs> Doesn't feel turbot-y though. Not now. A dog more likely. There's a dog, look. Things. Dog on the top of the bank there. Two knots are tied as well, and we're still getting dogfish. We're getting dogged out. Just getting back off the hook and getting back down. It's the only problem with mackerel. Mm. You can keep them for pop bait there, why not? I mean, you can take them as pop bait if you want. No, no, I've got no boat to go out. Oh, no boat, no freezer. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Tom's rod just started screaming off. Fish on. Right, whatever it is, it's gone. Or is it swimming with? 
it might be a tote. Right, there's something there. Yeah, it's a tote, I bet. Or a big bass. Come on. Big bass. Tote for a look of it. There's some, definitely some grunt to it. So let's try and keep it on for a show, shall we? Oh, no, it's gone. Tote, tote. Damn it. The tope struck again, everyone. We don't want tope. We're not rigged up for tope. We would have steel traces on if we wanted them, but we don't want them. We're after turbot, so they're just bycatch. Let's see if we can get the thing in. Well, everyone, Tom's tope on again. You have to bully it. <laughs> they're good fun, though. Yeah. Let's see if I can... Hopefully, I've hooked it in the corner of the gong. Put that ratchet on. Let him hear it. He's taken light. Del. Push it down. He's taken line. <laughs> He's ripping line. He's angry. He's an angry fish. They are. He's ripping line. They are good fun. Let's turn him around. Uh, I think this is quite a big one. And of course, my GoPro runs out of battery. Tom's GoPro's just run out of battery. Don't worry, Inglorious is here. To capture the footage. That's it. Well, he's either going to bite me off or... Big tote? Yeah. I laugh it was a bluey. Big blue shark, guys. Big bass, I reckon. He turned him round. He's coming back. That didn't take long. You might go again yet. 50 pounds. 50 pound trace, let's see if it holds up. You might go again yet. As soon as he sees that sunlight, he might rush back down. Luckily, it's on. I don't know, this is my. That's my go to rod. This, this rod's got some power in it. It's got a great, great action. Got a lot of fish on this rod. My favourite. Nice bend. Yeah. Bring it on, bring it on. The temptation is to crank the drag, but I'm not going to do that. Let's just coax it up. It'll, it'll do one more run when it sees the boat for sure. See if we can get it in that net, Danny. Yeah, we'll get him. Maybe clear my rod onto, that, onto yeah. there so it can smash around here. Yeah. Get, get a show for the camera. Add to the video. Let's see, you might might bite me off yet. Yeah? I've struck into it early enough, it's hopefully in the corner of it's gone. We're gonna try and bring this fish to you. I mean he's got the leader but the leader got knots yet. Oh here comes the leader. Right. Leader's nearly on. We'll take him off the dive in a minute, I'm not sure. Where is it? Take it around the front. It's going to come out so it's going to appear in a second. Yeah. yeah it's a tote, it's a big one. <laughs> it's a big one. You get that in the net. That's right. You've got him right on the side of the scissors. Oh, not yet. Not yet. He's going. He's going. Yeah, well, everyone, the battery died. I've just replaced the battery. Tom, stick the on. Oh, it's in the net. Oh, it's that, the net! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got the net! Grab the net. Oh, it's not the net, it's in the net. It's the net. I've got the net. It's not the net, mate. Have you got a gaff? Uh, yeah, let's try and... I'll try and turn it, maybe. Try and turn it. Go on, go on. Okay. Let's just take it the other way. Right, let's, let's I'll spin it. Yeah. I'll spin it, see if we can grab the tail. I just don't want my phone to it out. I, might, I could try and bring it on board like this. Come on, spin it. Come on, get a bit mad. Right, let's get that hook on. Right, 
on the side yeah, to see this. Yeah, you got a circle hook on. Yeah. That's why. Perfect. Watch your foot, that's a yeah. big fish. Is that thing filming? Yeah. Watch your leg. Yeah, yeah. That's a big tope, everyone. This is a big, big tope. Let's just grab it behind the head. Here we go. Oh, he's twisted. He's twisted. Let's just let him settle. Let's just let him settle for a bit. He's knackered my net. My net's had it. Chipped to mix fishing supplies. Jesus Christ! Hang on. This ain't a small tote, mate. This ain't no small tote, everyone. That is an absolute beast of a tote. Uh, uh, do you want to see if we can get on the water shot of it? As he goes away. Or not. Nah. Hang on. <sighs> That's a big tote, mate. That's a powerful fish. It's a powerful fish. Big, big tote, that. Let's see if I can lift it up. He's angry. He's an angry tote, but we're going to try and get you a show. Come on, don't stop twisting. Big female. Yeah. Angry, big, angry female. Right. Here we go. That's easy, 40 pounds. Easy. Watch she don't bite you. No, she's gonna bite you. There we go. That is a big tote. That's big. She's gotta be 40. Let's get her back. You ready to go back? Yeah. Use the other fish. Let's just get a show. Let's see if we can get a show. Yeah, boy. There you go. That's a fish. What do you reckon? Yeah, that's a proper fish. Aye, aye. All right, send her back. Let's get her back. Straight back down. Let's get some more turbot. Well, Tom's on again, the man of the hour. He's catching all the turbot, I can't catch one. And unfortunately we've got broken net, but we think it's a turbot. I'm gonna try and uh, manipulate this net a bit. See if we can land it. <laughs> you have to improvise. Might, might be a doggy, but I don't think so. I think it's a, the way it's going, I think it's a flat. We'll have to drive it in. <laughs> Here comes the leader, we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. It's a doggy, I think. Is it? Yeah. Doggy. Let's get me a little And it's a dogfish. So everyone, we're on our last drift. We've only had two turbot, a tope, a gurnard, a cottlefish, and a few dogfish, but we're still out here. Trying for one last one, the elusive turbot and the elusive brill. Hopefully, one of these four rods will get it. And Tom's into another tope. Oh, what? Long got it. Was it swimming? Is it swimming towards me? Is this? I don't know if this is the one with the with the heavy. Oh, it's gone. It's gone, is it? Yeah. I have to reel up. I don't know if it's taking the. It's probably just. Nip my hook off. Just started shredding Tom's line there. Screamed off. And Dan is into a fish. It's on, I think. I think. Definitely a bit of weight there. I found a live sand eel in the bucket. Huh. And she went on. That's the trick. That's the trick. Probably a dogfish now, my lot. We've got a busted up net down there, so if it is a flat fish, I'm going to have to improvise, but we'll, we'll figure out a bit of weight there. I've got your line. Oh, it's okay. a turbot. Is it? Yeah. Oh, hang on. Let's just... Oh, God. Do you want to... Oh, no, it's just come off. Has it? Look, it's there. It was only small anyway. I don't think was it was it? a keeper. All right. Send it back down again, mate. At least you've got a live bait still. Just shows, isn't it? Live bait. It just came off. 
There you go, Dan had a turbot on there, small turbot on his live bait. He's going to send oh, it back. to the side of the boat. He's going to send it back down again. I think I may have, I hopefully got it on camera. Right there the you side. go, Dan has had his first turbot. Yeah. Well, at least I have one. At least I have one, guys. There at least I go. have one. Well, he might get another one on his live bait. It obviously worked. Shows, it, it was obviously just oh, at hang the bait. On, hang on to the end. Yeah. Oh, well. Crazy. At least you got one to the side of the boat. Let's get some more. Here we go, guys. Do we think Danny's got another bite here. Something screwed off. Something grabbed it, didn't it? Oh, hang on. Let's set the drag on that one just in case. No, nothing. Nope. Hmm. Could well be a dog though. Well, last drift and Tom's in again. Could well be a dog. Could I just know. lost the turbot down the side of the boat. It was only a small one, so it wasn't a keeper size, but it would have been nice oh, to have got it on whatever film. Whatever it is, just dropped it. That would have been a flat. Just let go. Is it? Yeah. Weight came off. Ah, well, it wasn't a... It wasn't an enormous fish. It wasn't a huge fish, wasn't it? It's a small turbot again, I think, probably. It's... Or a cuttle. Or a cut. Yeah, it might have been a cuttle. Right. I know that bait's all mangled, but one last chance. Let's see. Might be a bass. I hope it's. No. It's a tote. <laughs> I hope it's a bass. Come on, be a bass. Tom's got a fish on again. I don't think. I wish it was a bass, but I, don't, I think I'm, I think I'm um, wishful thinking. Oh, please be a bass. Because bass swim swim with you as well, but not not quite at this rate, unfortunately. It is a tape, it's a small one because it's unless it hasn't realised it's hooked yet. Beer bass, come on, please. It's not bad, is it? It's not. Coming up. Well, it hasn't put up much of a fight, no. so it's a tote. It's coming up. What is it? Bass just hanging there. Let's see, shh, that's the other thing with the sun. There's no way. It's just hanging now. The tote. Just realise it's hooked. Look, unless it's a ray. No. Let's just try and. Some bend on that rod, everyone. We well, should be seeing the colour of his eyes soon, whatever it is. Tom's bullying it a bit. <laughs> Got the leader not. No, not, not far from it. Beautiful day out here been fantastic we had a couple of turbot as you've seen we had the top gurnard before a few dogfish cottlefish and a nice tote so there's the leader not no oh no it's not droplet. if this is a bass look at them it's very deep <laughs> this is a bass a record breaker some weight there not letting me do much at the moment. That's a tow ball there along that. Spinning away.
going, so I'm on the rod. Going under the boat. I'm trying to get around the other rod so I won't get around the other rod. should be alright if you just hang in there. Good fish, guys, good fish. Here's the leader knot there. There you go. See you in a second. Yeah, another taupe. You can see it? Not yet. Oh, I've seen collar then. Yeah, it's a big, big one. Another big one. I may not get this one into the boat. Oh, that's a big girl again. Big taupe, everyone. Straight in the side that those circle hooks work yeah, well. Yeah, I'm just going to nip this one up, I think. Yeah. Oh, it's gone anyway. There we go. That's Circle. what you're left with. Nothing. Nothing. Right, right. we're going to get these rods in. That's it. Let's start heading home. Okay, love that. Cheers for a good day out. Yeah, cheers for letting me come, mate. No worries, I'll have to uh, plan some more trips out. Yeah, yeah, no worries. All the best, Nice mate. one. Cheers, cheers mate. Thanks, cheers. Tom. Well, everyone, we're back into port now. Big shout out to Wahoo, Tom from Wahoo Fishing. If you haven't checked him out already, guys, go and check him out. He's got his own YouTube channel, does turbot long line and stuff like that, rod and line, fishing for turbot. Absolutely cracking channel. His boat is absolutely amazing. So please, 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 make sure you go and check out his channel. Go and give him a subscribe. Make sure you give him a thumbs up. So yeah, hope you enjoyed that trip. A few turbot, a few taupe. Not the best, but not the worst. We'll catch you on the next one, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time.